the River Pirate. I am Lady LaFleur. And today, we're going to sample a rum straight out of India. It's called Old Port Rum. Um, this is a deluxe craft rum, and it's made in Bangalore, India. I've never had Indian rum before. Heck, I didn't even know they made Indian rum, but it makes sense. Uh, it's got a, uh, on the picture, it's got a picture of a, uh, an old sailing vessel, probably, uh, East Indian men heading, uh, back to Britain. Um, little information on this rum itself. Um, it's made by a company called Amrit Distilleries. Amrit meaning, uh, it literally translates to, uh, um. Immortality. That's right, immortality. I don't know drinking it would cause us to be immortal, but what the heck, let's try. Um, another thing about this rum, uh, it's actually, uh, after it's distilled, it's stored in uh, ex-whiskey barrels and new oak barrels. Uh, in India, where apparently where this, locate, where this is located, it gets pretty hot, and um, they have like 12% evaporation off the barrels. It, it, put that in perspective. Scotland only has about 2% evaporation off their barrels. So uh, it looks like the angel's share is really high in India on this. So um, so let's uh, taste a sip of this rum and see uh, how people in India do this. Um, I will say one thing about the bottle. It's got a nice labeling on the top. Uh, some of this is actually in the uh, language from India. Uh, it is a metal screw cap. Um, so we don't, we're not dealing with a cork here at all, but I will say one thing, this metal cap is, uh, pretty, pretty sturdy. So I'm assuming it's for, uh, May production there. That? Yeah, absolutely. So, uh, let's, uh, take a pour and see what it looks like. Wow. That's a big pour. That is a big pour, but it's rum after all, right? <laughs> So anyways, let's uh, smell it and see what we smell. Oh, that's pleasant. Wow. Uh, they, they use uh, Indian sugar cane uh, to make this rum. And, and I smell definitely vanilla in it. And I don't know, it's almost like, almost like peanut butter or brittle or something. Ooh, take a smell that of sounds that. interesting. Let me smell do you smell that? It smells really nice. Oh, peanut butter brittle. You can smell it? Yeah, it's good. Oh, yeah. That does smell good. Yeah, it's it's very pleasant on the nose. Um, let's see if it tastes any good though. Wow. Um, my initial impression is it's a fairly smooth rum. I am feeling the burn on the back of my throat just about now, but it's fairly mild. Uh, this this one here is 40% alcohol, 80 proof, so it, it's, it's got a little bit of punch to it, but nothing objectionable. Um, let me take another sip of this. Yeah, definitely there's vanilla, and I can definitely taste a... Um, Almost like a peanut brittle. I mean, just the hint of it. It's really... I'm going to smell again. I had too much rum last night. Mm. Yeah. Very nice. Mm. Very, very nice. I'm kind of impressed. I had no idea that uh, India made uh, rum for the first place. And second, I didn't know it might be this great. Um, uh, it must be uh, how they do the distilling process, but uh, very, very, very tasty. Um, I, I saw, I paid about, I don't know, about 30 bucks for this rum, and um, I would say it's probably well worth it. Um, I um, certainly could sit and enjoy this. This is definitely a sipping rum. I don't get the impression from, just from my sip need of this, uh, that this is really a cocktail rum. I think this is something you would just... Just sit and enjoy uh, watching a movie or enjoying a sunset and and just uh, have maybe on the rocks or, or, or just uh, neat like I have it here. Um, How about I'll, chilled? You think it would taste better chilled? Yes, chilled out, I would agree. Bring chilled, out the flavors. Absolutely, chilled definitely. 
Uh, I'm going to take another sip because I'm really liking this rum. Maybe you should store it in your freezer to keep it nice and chilled. I'm not sure how the bottle would hold up. That's a good question, though. I don't know. I've never tried it. Um, other than that, I also want to just touch base on uh, rum videos. I'm going to have guest pirates do some of these reviews, yeah. not just me. Uh, Lady LaFleur was nice enough to step in uh, to at least uh, give her opinion of how it smelled. <laughs> um, so, uh, too much uh, rum last night. Yes. So, taking a little drying out today. So, But that's okay. So, uh, with that, uh, I would say enjoy the rum you're drinking. Shafar!